have a nationwide impact. Fox 14's Nikki Torres introduces us to the young designers and why they decided to tackle the abortion controversy for their tech project. Here you have four friends sitting around a table, working on their laptops, enjoying each other's company, while also planning how they want to make a difference in the world. We know like, we're fortunate to live in a state where abortion is legal, but a lot of other teenagers and women don't have that available or have that right. So we wanted to make a difference, I guess, just nationwide. Isabel Zhu and Hazini Jewelry are just 14 years old. While they're not old enough to drive, they created a fully functional mobile app, tackling a very mature subject. My Choice Housing provides housing for people trying to find abortions out of state while they uh, and resources to support them while they undergo the abortion process. They say the mobile app operates similarly to Airbnb. When you first go on the app, you can see you have the clinics page where we give you information on all the clinics in the area. Roe v. Wade gave women a federal right to abortion. When the Supreme Court passed it back to individual states to decide abortion access, confusion and uncertainty quickly followed. The app they created could help women find the care they need and provide a nationwide solution. Being teenagers, we're all over social media, so uh, we saw it everywhere, and so we started taking a deeper dive into it and looking into people's individual stories, and we realized that it was a problem that impacted many teenagers around the U.S., and we wanted to see what we could do. Jew and Jewelry even recruited two more team members to help create the app. Their co-workers, their little sisters, Cynthia and Aditi, both... 12 years old. Together they call themselves the STEM girls. I felt that it was like I was a little bit skeptical because for me I'm kind of like pushed into the side when my sister comes but with like doing technovation I felt that I really learned a lot more from STEM and coding so I felt that was a great personal thing for me. Technovation is a non-profit program encouraging girls as young as eight years old to pursue the STEM field. They haven't been able to uh, be exposed to STEM as much as we have and so we thought this would be a good opportunity especially since they're the same age. It gave them a good opportunity and us a good opportunity to all work as a team and it was also really convenient. Among steep competition, the STEM girls entered a competition within the program with their idea for My Choice Housing. They are now one of seven regional winners representing the U.S. The STEM girls encourage any other young people interested in the field to try it because they too could make a difference. I think they should go for it. Just start and they'll find something in STEM that they'll enjoy. In Bellevue, I'm Nikki Torres, Fox 13 News. While the app isn't out yet, winning their regional prize came, uh, came with a cash reward, so they tell Fox 13 they'll use it to help fund their app's development moving forward.